Hi guys, I just wanted to quickly touch base with you all and let you know what's happening down here in Teesside on December the 23rd. Every year we use this Facebook page or this Instagram page to try and reach as many children and families who are going to wake up on the 25th of December, Christmas morning, without a gift under the tree. Year after year, the need and the demand for those who are struggling, it grows and we try and always grow with it. We always try and help more. Well, this year is no different. We've had a record number of 52 children who without this campaign would wake up to absolutely nothing under the tree on Christmas morning. I just want to take a minute to thank the community here on Facebook and Instagram who support what we do, the amazing companies who make donations for us to make everything possible. And I just want to take you around on a quick tour of what to expect. Once the children who've been identified have not going to receive a gift, once them and the families have been down and they've had a private explore of the, the, the grottos and of the marquees, once they've been in, we open this up for everybody, the public. We have two rules. One, you must believe in the magic of Christmas. And two, we don't accept any payments. It is free for everyone. So once the children have been in who aren't going to wake up to a gift, we open this event up to everyone, the whole of Teesside. You can travel from as far as you want and everything that you come here to do is completely free of charge. The food, the drinks, the entertainment, the grotto, the presents, there's no charge for anything. So I want to take you around now and show you what is going to be happening on the 23rd of December right here down in Teesside. Let me take you around and show you the magic. So the first thing you're going to do is you're going to go in to the marquees. Now what you see there is Santa's sleigh. That doesn't live there. That is actually a stable for alpacas. The children can come and they can feed and they can pet the alpacas. That sleigh actually goes here which is just in front of this amazing wonderland setting and Santa's sleigh lands there and if you take a photograph it goes with a gorgeous backdrop now let me just take you through to the marquees we've got two marquees we've got the one on the left and we've got one on the right as you're walking up you're going to go at the one on the left and what you're going to do in here is you're going to come in and you're going to enjoy some amazing food and drinks and have a magical time so all the trees and the decorations have been done by Karen. And then when you come in, you can take your seat. But everything's free of charge. Children will have, adults as well, they'll have hot dogs with nice warm buns. They'll have real popcorn, which is made in front of them. We'll have curry and rice, which has been donated from an amazing guy called Mollick who has Bengal spice. We've got, in this urn, we're gonna have, um, we're going to have hot chocolate, we're going to have marshmallows and cream, we're going to have coffee and tea for the adults. Then we've got a real pizza oven which is making freshly baked pizzas. Again, you can eat as much as you want. We've got cartons of milk for the children to enjoy. We've got orange juice and then we've also had, who doesn't like school cake and custard? So we're going to have one of you, we're going to have our custard and we're going to have our school cakes. And you can come in and the adults and children remember after the children who aren't going to get a Christmas gift have been down privately, we open up to the public, the whole of Teesside. You can come in and you can eat as much as you want, drink as much as you want, and there's absolutely zero charge. And this has all been possible because some amazing companies have donated money, they've donated presents, those who've bought off the Amazon wish list, and the community on Facebook who support me year after year and make all this possible. So this here isn't going to be where Santa slays, that comes out tomorrow when Santa lands it. This is the stable for the alpacas. So the children can come here, they can take some of the carrots and they can feed the alpacas, they can pet them. And they're coming down from alpaca, alpaca. Then this isn't actually going to be the entrance, but I'm going to take you in now to the next marquee. Now I'm going to turn the camera up over, just so you can't see it. What you are going to actually do is you're going to walk in this door here this door is not going to be there so you'll walk in here and then on the left hand side we've got a cinema this is where the children can lay down on the quilt on the blanket the adults can sit there as well but this is a comfy warm area where you can sit down and watch a christmas movie but then on the other side we're going to have reindeer dust where the children can make reindeer dust and they can put it out on christmas morning on christmas eve 
for Santa to know where to stop. We're going to have face painting for the children. We've got our magical trees. We've got music here. We've got characters. We've got Spider-Man. We've got the Grinch. We've got um, Jesse. We've got Buzz. We've got Minions. And all of our trees here, again, have all been done by the amazing Debbie. So this marquee is going to be so much fun. There's going to be characters dancing. There's fun and games and music. And you can explore. And you can go wherever you want. We just want this to be magical for everybody. So I'm just going to now take you over and show you Santa's Grotto. So what happens with Santa's Grotto is the children who aren't going to get a gift, Santa's in there waiting for them. They've all got a time slot where the children, the families will go in, they will meet Santa and Santa will give them their gifts. Now these aren't just a gift. What's happened is I've spoke directly with them parents and them parents have got the children to write out a Christmas list. It's been my job to try and get as many of them gifts off that Christmas list as possible because we truly want the children to believe in the magic of Christmas and we want them to believe that they are special and that every child deserves a Christmas. So what's going to happen is, I'm just going to dim the lights. What's going to happen is Santa's bell is going to ring and the family are going to be sat out here waiting for their time to go in. When Santa rings the bell, the kids are going to walk in and what they're going to see is a magical grotto where Santa will be sat with the elves waiting for them. Now this here is where the children will be wowed. They'll walk in to what I can only, only describe as the most amazing grotto ever. Santa will be there, he'll know the name, he'll be waiting for them and then what happens is our elves will be here. We've got a team of elves out the back and then presents for them families are all ready for the children. So when the family comes in, they'll get to meet Santa. Santa will know all about them. These children remember, at this point, we're not going to receive a gift at Christmas, but because of the campaign that we've run, they're going to receive not just a gift, but as many of the gifts off their own Christmas list as possible. I'm going to take you around and show you how that works now. So all these bags here, are all the presents for all the families. So as you can see there, we've got 21 families, 52 children, and over 750 gifts that have been wrapped. All these bags here are all wrapped for the children. All them, yeah. All the way up to family number 21, which is down that side. Now the gifts that you see on here, on this table, these are for the public, so when the, the public come in and we open up to the public they'll come in they'll get an appointment to see Santa and every single child will leave with a gift and again I have to reiterate this is free of charge there's no charge for everything so what happens is as the children come in who are part of the public and not part of the campaign Santa will be talking to them and we ask them what they like and let's just say for instance one of the child one of the children say I really love monster trucks well this present is there waiting for him so our team out here will be bagging these presents up and they'll be taking them through to the grotto for Santa to give to the children. We want to make sure that every child, no matter their age, no matter the circumstances, whether they are getting a gift or not, these children here need to believe in the magic of kindness and the magic in this true spirit of Christmas. This means so much to me on a personal note. For those who don't know who I am, my name's Mike Hind. I own a gym in Middlesbrough and we're called Mass Body Gym and I own a meal prep company as well and I have an amazing following on social media of people who just want to be kind and be nice and that's one thing that I want to try and promote. I want to try and promote people to be kind and to be nice to other people. I want our children to use social media as a tool not as a weapon where they can return to school and when they're talking about what they did over Christmas they can mention the fact that there was a grotto down in Teesside where they attended and it was amazing and everything was free and there was no charge and they can just get that spirit of kindness and giving guys I just want to share this with you I want to show you what is going to happen on the 23rd of December down here in Teesside made possible by some amazing people who donate money we have the likes of John Hughes and Gerard May who are from HMH Civils Dean Benson they are our two main supporters of this campaign but then we've got loads of companies who build the websites, who donate money, who buy gifts. Some amazing companies who do that and they can all be seen as a special thank you to them. 
over on our website that is built by Itchy Robot and that's www.tsidegrotto.co.uk and year after year that website is how you put people forward so if next year you are struggling no matter what your circumstances are now if your children are not going to receive a gift at Christmas then please visit the website put your children in yourself or someone you know forward so next year they don't have to worry because of this amazing community here on social media this is possible guys thank you for watching this video i'm really sorry for taking up a lot of your time i hope you all have a very very merry christmas i hope you all can go in to 2024 filled with joy and happiness where we all have one thing in common and that's we just want the children to be happy we want them to grow up in a world that we've left for them when we go our children will still be here we want to make sure that our children are growing up in a world full of joy and happiness and kindness not one full of hate and and trolls we can do this guys if we all continue to be kind to each other and to be helpful and it doesn't have to be the fact that you have to donate money just a comment or a share or a like that helps pages like this that helps communities like this grow and allows people to see it guys thank you for watching have a very very merry christmas and a very happy new year